man has to say. I can't wait. I love Warjack, man. He's also a legend. God, it, it just feels so goddamn good to know I'm still here. It does. It really does. I mean, goodness gracious, I, I would have I would have been left with nothing. This is all I've got. Before I talk about what what's next for Warjack, I just want to say that Alan N, I saw your thing, buddy. I fucking love you. I've respected you my whole career, and I wish you a very happy retirement. Thank you for all you've done. Stan Van Sice, fuck you to hell. You deserved every piece of what you got at the chamber. Opie Smith, if you ever need a friend, you always got War Jack's number. And with all that shit under the way, and the fact that War Jack is still here, still ready to whoop ass, still ready to be the best I can be, let's see what the hell's next for War Jack. Because I was your inaugural badass champion. I've always been a badass. And I'm upset that that legacy has not been carried to this company. But ladies and gentlemen, understand that the badass legacy will always be in War Jack's soul. And I will wrestle till the day I'm dead. So whoever decides they think they have a goddamn... What? Let me just stop you right there. Old man Jack didn't want to go in his coffin yet. Okay, okay. I heard that under your voice, War Jack. Who the hell am I? I'm Mr. OTT, IZD. And man, you stink. You smell like whiskey, shit, piss, Viagra, Pepto-Bismol. You need to retire, Holmes. Hey, there's a home over there. I think it's called the Moorings. Look, Ozzy D is, Ozzy D. Uh, you know, it's, uh, it's weird that this is happening. I would have never expected the day that the awesome Marco Archangel wannabe, Jobber from the Indies, and Warjack could be in the same ring, but here we are. Uh, what's your name again? I said, you know my name, shut up, bitch. All you people in San Jose, shut up, bitch. You all a bunch of bitches, bitch. You see, Mr. OTT has been severing heads and impressing backstage, and man, I'm back. And Warjack, Mr. OTT's next for you. Is that so, yeah? You're next for Warjack? Says who? Says who? I, I was thinking maybe I go run it back with some rebel kids. I was thinking maybe I hit up my friend Kid Valley and see if he want to tag, but you, the guy that looks like every other guy that's never made it, you? You and what army? Listen, bitch, all right? All these old bitches in the locker room think they still got something. You know, Galactic Greg, yeah, I'm gonna call him that, I don't give a shit. I gave him that in Japan. I mean, hell, I didn't want him to kill himself. Ethan could say, I mean, he's a special Olympian. I couldn't beat him. It's like me being Rob Admiral against a Billy Shortcake. So you're making excuses for yourself, is that so, Mr. IZD? Oh, real bad reputation you're causing for yourself. You know, you're real, you're real good at getting on people's nerves with your big head, peanut-headed ass. So here's the thing, IZD. You're asking for an ass beating that I've given everybody else. Is that really what you want? No, it's not what I want. I just want to 
make sure that your old ass stays in place. You know, all these matches, I mean, I've been put up against so many people that I, I can't beat them. I mean, what the hell, right? But you, I mean, you're just, I got no sympathy for you. Nobody here cares about you. They want to see Mr. OTT beat Mr. ODD. Old dickhead dumbass. That's what I'm called now. That's not even clever, man. OTT, what does that stand for? I don't, I don't really even care what it stands for. What matters is this, Ozzy D. You have a lot of confidence for a big, sore, big-headed loser. And if you want me, you got all of it next week. Of course, we're gonna, it's not going to happen right now. You don't got the balls to face fresh talent right now. I mean, I could be in a minor car accident by next week, and then you'd probably beat me because of that. Well, if that's the case, you want to wait seven days to get your wo old ass warmed up? I'm cool with that. Don't worry, man. I got your wheelchair already ready. Next week, your bitch ass is going to be in that car. Young ass pieces of shit, man. Wow, this, this big-headed asshole is really targeting, like, everybody. Like, Ethan Guiseo beat him.